Chris from Chris Drums here. You probably know that I do a lot of different uh, drum covers and, and drum chops and shorts on this channel. Uh, one of the other goals that I actually have uh, for this channel is actually to help motivate um, you, um, to, to help uh, give you some insight, give you guidance uh, on different things uh, in the music world, in life, uh, different things that I've had a chance to experience. So I'm going to get a chance here uh, as I put out different videos to be able to give you a chance to see how different things in my life have affected how I've made decisions and, and things that I've done that maybe you could take with you. Um, one of the big things that I always think about um, is um, adversity. Uh, or, or, you know, when you are down, um, it's hard uh, to, to come back from that. Um, uh, one of the things I remember about adversity and about having to come back from that was um, I've been a musician for a, for a long, long time. And uh, I took a break um, in the industry um, and I, I decided to race BMX. I had never raced before. Um, in my second year, um, I took a, uh, an injury. I had a, a clean break of my tibia. Uh, I didn't even realize it was broken. And uh, I did a 360 over the bars in the last turn. And I landed on my, on my feet. And um, to make matters worse, <laughs> not only did I not know it wasn't broken, um, but my tire was so overinflated uh, that it blew like a gunshot by about a foot and a half from my face. Um, and the thing that was hard about that was um, I was sitting in a good position for the state championship. And what ultimately wound up happening was I, I wasn't able to compete. And um, it was really dejecting. But I had a really good friend of mine tell me about how I should watch these different motivational type videos um, just to help me along in my journey um, because it, it was really really difficult um, you know especially when you have a competitive spirit and, and you want to get out there and, and of course you know you have social media and you see all your friends and you see everybody else is out there competing and meanwhile you're, you're stuck in, in a cast um, I was very lucky that it, it was a clean break. I didn't require any surgery, um, but it was it was really tough. And one of the things that I actually found during that time was that this adversity was kind of eating me alive. It was inside of me, um, you know, and and it was it was hard. Uh, I'm, you know, I can't stress that enough, how, how hard it was to actually have that inside of you where you, you can't compete and you, you can't do what you love. And, um, and it was interesting because I was watching one of these videos and it was, you know, it's so easy for us when everything is going right, when we have this smooth sailing, you know, our bills are paid. Um, you know, we've got great relationships, we've got great friendships, you know, everything is just going in our way. It is so easy to have faith and to have happiness under those circumstances. Um, but it's so interesting because the real test actually comes when you actually get knocked down like I did. Um, and to have to realize that you have to kind of take a few steps back. Um, Life can be really, really hard in those aspects. Um, but what I ultimately did was I wound up resting it. I followed my doctor's orders. I followed my wife's orders <laughs> not to get on my bike. Um, I, the doctor said, if you go out, you know, you very well could re-injure it. And you're not talking a few weeks at this point. You're talking six months to a year. And so I said, okay. And I... I did what I needed to do and ultimately I wound up coming back the following year and I actually made state three on the podium in my group and it was such a huge accomplishment to be able to come back from that and to be able to 
realize that, you know what, adversity can kick you down, but ultimately you can come back from it. And that's true in any walk of life, whether you race, whether you play music, whether you've lost a job or, or anything along those lines. One of the most important things to realize is that you may hit the bottom, but you can come back from that. It may not be in your time frame. It may not be in what you expect, but you can take heart in the fact of knowing that you're gonna come back from it. And you're actually gonna be a lot stronger for it. I hope this helped. Um, please, if you enjoy a lot of the videos that I am posting, definitely hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, turn on the little bell, for uh, some notifications and we'll catch you soon. Thanks.